China suspends flight to Pyongyang. Air China suspending flights between Beijing and North Korea, capital of Pyongyang. The suspension of service by the state-owned carrier will go into effect from Monday, according to Chinese state media. A representative for Air China said the airline was temporarily suspending flights due to weak sales. Quote, we will schedule flights on this route based on passenger demand, the representative told CNN. The suspension, however, comes amid rising tensions on the, North Korea, uh, on the Korean Peninsula, North Korea, which is developing nuclear and ballistic missile capabilities, is facing increased pressure from the Trump administration to curtail work on the programs. Air China has been operating three round-trip flights a week between the two capital cities, according to its published timetable. But service has become sporadic in recent months. The suspension threatens to sever a key link between the isolated nation and the outside world. The U.S. and its allies have tried for years to squeeze the North Korean government's supply of money and cut it off from the global banking system. All that seems to have done is develop Pali Yang's ability to dodge sanctions. China is North Korea's economic bedrock, accounting for more than 80% of its smaller neighbors' foreign trade. North Korea's biggest source of foreign currency is believed to come from the millions of tons of coal it sells to China every year. This accounted for about a third of official exports in 2015. President Trump issued a series of tweets on Tuesday calling on China to solve the North Korean problem. I explained to the President of China that a trade deal with uh, the U.S. will be far better for them if they solve the North Korean problem. North Korea responded by warning of a, quote, merciless response to any hostile military, economic, or political moves by the reckless, quote, Trump administration, according to a statement from a North Korean army spokesman that appeared on the state-run news agency KCNA. Let's take a quick look at this uh, footage here. North Korea may be preparing for sixth nuclear test. With the looming threat of a nuclear showdown, new images of Kim Jong-un guiding a special forces operation, North Korean commandos jumping out of planes, their leader all smiles. Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe warns North Korea already may have the capability to deliver missiles equipped with deadly sarin nerve gas. Incredible news, the security situation around our country is getting